Hello, welcome back. Uh, this video is about seven turns on from the last video, I think. Uh, I'll cover all the major things that have happened as the video goes along. Right, I'll accept that. Um, all the details, uh, like literally all the details, are in the video notes as well. I've pretty much uh, written down everything that happened in between uh, the turns from the last video to this video. Uh, the Portuguese... Right, they've got artillery now as well. I think they might have had at the end of the last video as well. Yeah, the Portuguese fleet has been defeated on the eastern coast. I don't, not, I don't think I destroyed every single ship there, but... Uh, they seem to have run off if they did have any remaining. Uh, I've been sending this privateer up here to do some scouting. I've still got a national or natural wonder to find. Uh, what else happens? Right, um... Oh, it's a World Congress vote now. Alright, so I'll do that in a second. Uh, I rejig some of these rounds, uh, making sure that Mecha had all the slots filled. Uh, the Siamese completed the Crystal Redonta as well. I completed the uh, Neutrofenstein in Warsaw, so my happiness is really high at the moment now. Uh, Indonesia took Hanoi. Uh, the last social policy I took was Total War. Uh, which is extra production for military units and experience. Both uh, Warsaw and Lords now have... They're basically getting 75 XP per unit they make. Uh, Tech-wise, I got Ballistics. Just built that unit there. And... What else did I get? I finished Refrigeration. I think that's it, but I bulbs. I used a couple of bulbs, a couple of scientists to get those. Um, oh, and I've used some diplomats, uh, which I've moved around now to get some votes. Uh, you can see Shaka is going to vote against arts funding. You can see that at the bottom. And I used, I bought. I bought these uh, votes off both of these for a small amount. Um, and I got Polynesia to vote yay on world ideology autocracy. So I'm going to stick all my votes into that. We should... Well, I assume Indonesia is going to vote for most of that. So we're going to get probably at least 11 to 16 votes. And... Portugal and Siam only have 13 between them. So they can get basically 13 max, and we're going to get at least 10, depending on... I think it's going to go through basically almost no matter what. So I'll put my 7 through on that, and there's a chance I might be able to stop at spending as well. Alright, so I'll commit the delegates. There's yay now, yeah. Uh, so what else is that? Uh, right. Artillery. I've been building uh, fighters and bombers mainly uh, in between the turns. I've started trying to get my archaeologists up as well. I've built a couple. Uh, Siam's cultural pressure is really high now. Uh, so where is it? They've got... Oh, that's going up all the time. It's a real danger of them winning cultural victory now, so I have to get over there quickly, very quickly. Uh, Siam, they've actually gone above the level. It says this rises slowly against myself in Indonesia, I guess, so uh, it's Indonesia that's the hardest for them to get. Still only got dissidents, even though they got two pressure. Right, uh, anti-aircraft gun. I'm gonna make this a healer. Mm. 
There's a trade deal that's run out. I think I'll keep all these there for now. I built a harbour in Damascus, so I don't really need this railroad now. Uh, the harbour from Honolulu is connected to the railroad network, and it, its harbour is providing the railroad bonus there, basically. Right, uh, oh, I connected the whales by there as well. Uh, this can stay there. Probably need to get some ships down here. The Portuguese might threaten my trade, potentially. Uh, right, I built a great profit last turn, I think it was. So we get this over to Aventa, try and ally them up. I'm thinking of doing that for forever, basically. Uh, so Honolulu. I think I moved this cargo from bank that last turn. I think the best one is Kazil. I don't really want to trade to the mages because it gives them a load of science because they're quite far behind now. So I do Kazil. Uh, That's what we're looking like in the F9 screen. I'll leave that general there. If they ever move that unit well, actually, I can't move him in with that open borders, can I? I do want to get that, but I don't think I'm ever going to be able to get it unless I did Citadel bombing all the way through, like there, there. Uh, Citadel there, and then the Citadel there I'd have to do to get that. Uh, so it's pretty unlikely. Right, and all my artillery has come back from the eastern coast and they're over here now, basically. Uh, Siam did actually uh, have a great war infantry unit here last turn which I killed so I'm not sure if there's an invasion coming in or if it's just a, a lone one. I don't think their military is very strong. I think I lost a couple of units as well. I lost the Camel Archer and the Gatling Gun. Uh, Gatling gun got shot up and the camel archer I badly placed I put it by there and they got shot up by a load of artillery right, I'll place that one can heal help heal the fighters and bombers in that unit there basically uh, Right, so let's take down Funkal. Probably need to get my Lancer in range. Uh, reasonably soon. Use the Lancer to take the city. Now, camel. Yeah, more artillery. I think we've got six artillery pieces. Right, that can heal. I guess I use this to attack the city. Oh, before I do it, I need to do air sweep. Uh, they've got one triplane left. Right, 
no resistance. It's not going to do much damage at all, but I might as well use it. It gets experience every time as well. Try planes. I think I just leave the try planes on intercept. Right, so lots is finished uh, anti-aircraft gun. I built the heroic epic here, so it gets um, morale promotion. So that gives combat strength of 15% for non-air units. So I should make uh, concentrate on making non-air units basically here. If I'm going to make use of it. I'm going to make another anti-aircraft gun I think. Right, I think that's it for the turn. I think I'm actually out of uh, crabs so I should refuse that. We have to get Indonesia into the war here. Because they made peace there. Siam have actually entered the Tomic era somehow. Which is a bit surprising. I'm not sure what tech they got. Um, they might actually have atomic theory. It's worrying. Right, so Arts Funding has passed sadly. Uh, it's got six votes against and seven four. So just. F that's a pain. And. What's our ideology is now autocracy. Uh, Indonesia didn't use all its votes. Didn't really. Probably should have put some votes into against the arts funding actually. Right, so. What world ideology autocracy? It doesn't actually. Should show you what it does there, but it hasn't. What's this? Oh wow! Because uh, world ideology is now autocracy, I've moved ahead of Siam because we got two extra votes. Uh, you get if you if that's your ideology. So what do I? I'll come back to that in a second, actually. Right, I need to get... They want silks. Which... I think Leventa has. Yeah, it does. So... I'll convert them to Islam. And I should get silks next turn. So I don't think I'll give um, money to Ragusa. Right, great old bomber. I think I'll go uh, city. Nine turns when I get fight some bombers, that's going to make a massive difference. Right, I've got crabs back now. 39. Not really sure how it's that good.
Right, so that's actually gotten rid of my dissidents because uh, it's given too pressure from the world ideology. Even Siam now has dissidents. Right, so that was absolutely massive getting that. Uh, Started building a road just to give me easy access to Funkal here. I've actually got a ship there which I need to kill off. I might use my bombers on that if they're in range. I'll move this one back. Uh, actually, I put this one on the coast uh, so I can try and take down that any ships that are near there. So Funkal should fall probably in a turn or two, hopefully. It's just a case of keeping it then. Uh, they're going to have a navy there. Figure out how to do that in a bit. Right, so... Quick bomber. So their privateer is actually in range. Uh, they're getting negatives now because of poor happiness. I should probably should use near sweep here. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five. No resistance. Uh, that repairs, so I'll use that one. Sweep here. No resistance. So I use last bomber on a city. Right. Uh, great war bomber built there. I think I'll. Continue actually building Great War bombers. Um, I need just need to get these two cities are just going to be building military like man. Right, so proposal. Right, I'm actually going to need a minute to figure out what I want to pick. So I'll be back in a set.
Right, I've had to look through all of these uh, possible enactments. Uh, there's some nice ones that I wouldn't mind having, like World Religion, for example. But you can actually uh, repeal uh, resolutions that have been enacted. My biggest threat at this point is Siam's tourism, so I need to lessen that, basically. I think the one to go for is repealing cultural heritage sites, because they have a huge amount of world wonders. Uh, we probably have the second most now, maybe, or Portugal does. So it will affect us a bit, but I think that's the one I'm going to pick. Um, it's debatable, to be honest. Right, so uh, I'll commit the proposal for that. Let's write one, yeah. Right, I think that's it for the turn, so I'll end the I'll do next turn. I've actually got an archaeological site done. Uh, this one is within range of, range of Samoa, so I'll do Great Landmark again. Uh, it's Renaissance. Two-handed sword, eh? Right, so I'm getting six culture off that. Uh, I've got one on coming by there as well. It's using it, which is great. Right, so next turn. Right, so he likes me even more, I think. I forgot to get him in another war then. Uh, I should probably try and get him to attack the Zulu. The Zulu, because they're, I think they're in revolutionary wave. So they've got a chance of their cities actually flipping to me or Indonesia now. I think uh, Zulus might have actually switched to autocracy then. Yeah. Not sure if that's good or bad for us actually. Probably good. Right, so we've got Leventa now, so we've got bonuses for silks. And I've finally got them as an ally after all these uh, turns of wanting to be. Right, so Leventa declares war on those. Building Manhattan Project. 30 turns that's going to take. Might leave it there, I'm not sure. Right, so Zulus are back to content. This is a puppet, so I'm not really actually get the forest done for war, so. Oh. It's interesting. Didn't take it, sadly. Didn't even destroy it. This is probably one of the ships that they retreated. In between the videos, I actually attacked a couple of ships of. Uh, with privateers, but I failed to take any of them, even though I destroyed them. Uh, so, archaeologist over here. Another one over there. I'll come back to that cargo ship in a bit. Might be able to take Funkal this turn, if not this turn, probably next turn. Right, I'll 
this sweep. Uh, if I do it there, I can. It'll be in range of the city and the now ship. Oh, I can't do it there actually. It's out of range. Uh, but there. Right, no resistance. Gonna be pretty close. If I use that, I can bomb it or attack it. I think I can actually take this city this turn. So I'll move the Lancer up. Is there any way I can? Pillage, uh, move that. There's actually an artillery piece there. That's flat land. Right, so what else have we got here? Definitely need to take that out. Uh, probably use um, one of my interceptors to do this though. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm at a range of bombers for that. I think I've got a, a ranged fighter I can use though to attack that artillery piece. Oh, I'm actually at a range there. Um, This one has range, I'll attack the artillery piece. I think they've got an artillery piece in Villanova de Gaia as well, so I need to be a bit careful with my placement if I bring anything in over here. Uh, right, so let's try and take the city. Brilliant. It's quite an amazing city actually. Uh, right, so I'll puppet that. I uh, can't see any ships over here. Oh, I can potentially. Alright, uh, doesn't look like. Can I use my cav? No. move in here. I don't want to move my fighters in quite yet. I think I will move this uh, infantry by there, even though can be attacked by villain over the Gaia probably. Right, Cav can go on the road as well. Uh, General can go over there. Can heal up. Quick 
profit. Don't really have much uh, things I can use a great profit on, so I'm probably gonna have to save that up. I'll uh, bring it down south though, for now. So I've got a triplane. I'm tempted to uh I think I am gonna move one of those in to Funkal. It's risky. Any boats coming through in I'm gonna lose it, but Cargo ship, do that in a second. So the factory's completed in Baghdad. What do I want now? Uh, there's quite a lot still I want. Uh, but research lab for now. Mecca. I think I built another archaeologist. And probably another archaeologist there. Right, uh, I think it's probably been about half an hour actually, so I'll call this an end to the video. I'll figure out the cargo ship in between turns and if I want to keep those buildings. So, thank you for watching. Please uh, like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time.